Hi everyone. I'm Dr. Zainab Bora and we have with us Dr. Ankur who secured a rank 124 in this uh, INICT exam. Uh, first of all, congratulations from the entire team yeah. of uh, Cerebellum. How are you feeling? Uh, tell us what the journey has been like. I'm feeling very relieved now. Um, yeah. After the exam, a lot of anxiety was there about the result. So um, uh, my journey with BTR was from January. Um, I subscribed to BTR. Only after I got to know that NITPG is postponed. Then I uh, uh, I joined BTR and then ma'am uh, I was started preparing seriously for I9 May. Mm -hmm. I attended all the uh, classes and uh, gave all the ENDs and okay. I attended all the discussions also. Okay. I, in I9 May I got a rank of 800 and mm -hmm. then uh, ma I didn't got my branch so I didn't opt it for it. Okay. And then NIT PG, I got a rank of 2645, which was, uh, I, I was getting a college in my uh, state only. So mm. I was, uh, and then, but NIT PG got postponed. So I attended again for the INISS in November. Right. Uh, after NEET, uh, you were getting the branch that you wanted. Yes, so sir. so were you seriously preparing for INI or no, 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 no. not really? I'm only because the counseling got so postponed, then only when I started preparing. Only for the last 20 days, I think I have uh, prepared seriously. What would you have done in the last 20 days? I'm only I uh, when then I was not in a mood to go back to my books again. So I just opened the app and my BTR 2.0 was released by then. Hmm. So um, I just uh, read passively the, through the notes and attended all the new ENDs. And yes. That was only my source of preparation in the last 20 days. Right. So goes on to show that it's the long-term knowledge, right? And it's the exam-giving uh, aptitude, which which you probably learned over this one year, that how to attempt exam. I think that uh, that is something which is very interesting because a lot of toppers this time have been students who have done well in NEET and just gave the exam because counseling got postponed, right? Yes. So so goes on to show that once you learn how to crack MCQs, there is there is no looking back. It's not really uh, preparation in the till the last minute that comes. So obviously you have to be consistent, uh, but but both things go hand in hand. Um, uh, tell me about your MBBS. How were your basics? Where are you from? Um, I'm from. Uh, I've done my MBBS from Guwahati Medical College in Assam, and uh, my and uh, during MBBS I was in um, uh, top fifty in my university only. So I was an average student only. Right. So I was not like a class thorns. So that was my journey so far. What what have you been studying then? I mean, were you relying on last minute, you know, what are seniors mark as books or, or did you read textbooks? Did you start watching videos in MBBS? What was that like? I, I started watching uh, videos from uh, uh, final year only. Up till hmm. final year, I was not uh, studying hmm. very seriously. Hmm. But uh, preparation for uh, entrance started only during my internship. Whenever I got uh, my, uh, my, my chill postings, then only I started okay. my preparation. And what were you doing then? Uh, did you start with revision videos or, or did you go? Uh, and initially, I did the main videos only. Right. After, after doing the main videos, I uh, realized that it was not possible to revise everything. Correct. So what I did was I annotated everything that I felt important in the BTR book. Okay. and made it only a single book so that I could revise it multiple times before my exam. Right. So so a lot of people get fused, you know, how to use uh, BTR. I've seen many versions, you know, by now. So so what you did was, apne BTR pada, you studied BTR and then whatever were the extra points from main, yes, yes. Or main videos, you added onto it. So yes. for that, you had seen the videos earlier. So, yes, so it's easier for you to go back to yes. them, right? So that's and one And once you have seen the main videos, also it is easier to grab the BTR means because it is so right. much concise and so... so. Yeah. So what is your advice to, you know, juniors who are starting out preparation now? Let's say they are in the middle of the internship. Most of the students start preparing now, you know, uh, December-ish for the NEET exam. So what would be your advice uh, with regard to how to best uh, use BTR, you know, retrograde, start with revision and then go to BTR or what is what is your, uh, you know, suggestion? I think uh, it is important to have base now because uh, the questions, especially in NEET PG, this time yeah. was very conceptual. Right. So start with the RR videos if you don't have time, then do BTR and 
means annotate everything into BTR so right. that you have only one copy to revise in multiple times. Multiple revision is important. Yeah. And and what is your take on MCQs? You know, how how did you practice questions? Was it just ENDs that you did or on daily basis you were solving? No, no I, the cost, custom modules also I solved daily. I will set a target of 100 men and custom modules. But ENDs uh, just give you an idea of means open all the options, how to approach your options. So Correct. that is so you sold all 4.0 till 4.0 you had yes, sold? Ma yes, ma yes. That is something very important, you know. A lot of students yes. just rely on videos. I think MCQ practice, if you learn, you know, that is what shows in your result as well. How Even if you did study, you had developed that art and, and that uh, helps. So that's something which is very In important. the last few years, I remember you scrolling everyone that everyone is watching the videos but not yeah. attending the ENDs. <laughs> and that. I feel like the trend is changing, you know. People are so used to passive learning now that they just don't and want ENDs to. ENDs are very important. I think just gives you an idea how to approach these questions. Correct, correct. Right. So, so uh, what plans now? What is the branch that you've been aiming for? I am aiming for MD medicine. Hmm. So, you will get it this time. Amazing. Congratulations. And, and uh, I'm sure you're going to make a great physician and uh, wishing you all the very best from our entire yeah. team. <laughs> Thank yeah. you so much for talking to me. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you.